So then guys, this is the service 50 from Wolverhampton to Wensfield. And this is operated by National Express West Midlands from the Wolverhampton Depot. And this was filmed in early 2020, just before COVID-19, the coronavirus outbreak. And we are exiting onto Ring Road St David's. And I hope you enjoy the journey. Now, as you probably know, in early 2023, uh, the 50 uh, will be removed from service uh, and will be withdrawn from National Express West Midlands. Uh, this is due to the low passenger usage and however uh, we don't know what might replace this. Maybe another operator might take over, maybe Diamond, Banga, maybe Select might do it again uh, since they did the emergency tender for iGo buses. Or maybe Let's Go might take it over, uh, but we just don't know for sure just yet. So anyway, we're just exiting uh, the city of Wolverhampton and we are heading uh, towards Wensfield. Now, as you probably know, the 50 runs Monday to Friday, uh, but no longer operates uh, on Saturdays. So that means there is no more services uh, on Saturdays on the 50 uh, since it was run by iGo buses so we're just waiting uh, to cross over so we can then depart to head out towards Wensfield so I hope you're all keeping well and looking after yourselves now we will be uploading more and more videos on the channel on a regular basis so we're gonna now go under Wolverhampton railway station which is served by the West Coast Mainline trains via Birmingham uh, and the train operators that operate the, the services from here are West Midlands Railway, Transport for Wales, London Western and Community West So then guys, as you can tell with the bus uh, we got is an ADL Enviro 200 which is long wheel based. Now long wheel based ADL Enviro 200s are usually built for the big urban areas but however they do appear on the little side uh, road routes uh, like the 28 for example and even the 24 but those routes are operated by Pensnet Depot. This route is operated by Wolverhampton Depot alongside various routes uh, that serve Wolverhampton, except the number nine towards Warsaw. So the routes uh, that uh, are run from the Wolverhampton depot, so let me bear, so just bear with me uh, for a second uh, or minute. Uh, uh, so I'm gonna show you all the routes that are operated uh, by Wolverhampton depot. Uh, so we've got the number one from Technal Wood to Dudley, Two Bushbury to Warstones, three Ford Houses to Castlecroft, four uh, I-54 to Springhill, five Wolverhampton to Codsaw, six 6A Wolverhampton to Wabaston, and of course seven Dudley to uh, Wollaston Junction, which interwerks with the IC2, eight Wollaston Farm to Wolverhampton, ten uh, Wolverhampton to Burton, ten A Wolverhampton to Pattingham, ten B to Codsaw, eleven Wolverhampton to Rundale, and of course, 15, 15 A, Wolverhampton to Mary Hill, 16, Wolverhampton to Stowbridge. And of course, uh, there's 25, Wolverhampton to Penderford Business Park, 27, 27 A, Wolverhampton to Dudley. And there's quite a few routes that are operated on behalf of the Wolverhampton Depot. So uh, they all serve, most of them serve Wolverhampton Bus Station, but the rest also serve the city centre of Wolverhampton. 
So then guys, as you can tell, we've got more videos to come very soon on the YouTube channel, Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures. So I'm happy to say yes, we will be delivering more and more uh, YouTube uh, videos to the channel uh, very, very soon. So please stay tuned for that guys, here on Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures, the best YouTube channel that you can name of all time. Yes, the best YouTube channel that you can name of all time. So we have got uh, penciled in at present, uh, the 74A, uh, Dudley to West Brom. That is still going well, according to plan. So we are still saying, yes, it will be going ahead. But we just don't know for sure just yet. But we might change it in case if we do need to change. But we just don't know if it's going to be 100% accurate. So please stay tuned, guys. And I will let you know as soon as possible. The same goes with all the Let's Go routes in Wolverhampton. So we have said, yes, we'll try our best to make sure we do deliver the Let's Go Bus Service videos that will uh, be uploaded very soon. So I will keep you up to date with that one. So um, everything is still going well according to plan. So then, guys, um, after Route 74A and uh, hopefully the Let's Go bus videos, uh, we're going to aiming uh, to cover more handful of services um, in the week after, like we are penciling in for the 15 Kidderminster to Starport. Then on the 11th, we will not be doing any bus videos uh, in the flesh. It's because due to the fact it will be... The day of remembrance as it as we uh, mark the start of the remembrance uh, day service. So 14th, um, all being well, we should be doing Stafford, the 826 uh, to Lidgefield, which is run by D&G Chase Rider. So we're going to try and pencil in the, the 84, uh, well, the 826. Uh, then the 57 established Wall Heath on the 15th. We're hoping to do the 298 and 299 on the Thursday, the special version. Then on the 18th, we just don't know what we're going to do. Uh, but we just have to see what's going to happen. And then on the twenty, and then on the 22nd, I think uh, we don't know what we're going to do on that date. We probably just might just do locals. And then on the 24th, I think... We'll do the eight up to Hales Park. So just stay tuned, guys, here on Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures. So then, guys, we're continuing on our journey on the Service 50 towards Wensfield. Uh, so we are continuing to maintain uh, the channel as well, Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures. So please stay tuned for more future videos that will be added onto the channel in the not too distant future i'm sure you will that's what we like to hear so we're on our way to wensfield so there's more exciting videos to come on the channel than ever before and i'm pleased to say yes we will be doing more videos very very soon and it is important that i can still stay up to date uh, with more fun that will come on the channel uh, in the near future, of course. It's got to be a definite. And there will be a definite. That I will consider uploading more videos. Onto the channel. Uh, very, very soon. So. Hope you're all looking after yourselves. And taking care. So. The YouTube channel. Uh, is still on in good hands at the moment. And we will. Uh, monitor this on a daily basis. And uh, the channel isn't going to go far. We are going to continue uh, to succeed with more and more exciting videos uh, that will come very, very soon. Please stay tuned, guys. And hope you are all well and looking after yourselves. So the channel is still here for us. And uh, we will uh, make sure that the channel doesn't go far and doesn't hit the wash away our shores so we will do our best to keep the channel afloat at all times yes we will 
So then, guys, uh, we're still travelling on the service um, 50 from Wolverhampton to Wensfield. So we are almost completing our journey on the service 50. So I hope you are enjoying the 50 service, uh, Wolverhampton to Wensfield. Uh, now we will be continuing to maintain the channel as always. Um, so more and more videos will be coming up very soon here on Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures, the best YouTube channel that you can name of all time. So uh, we are going round, still on the 50, so we'll still continue to maintain the channel of all time. So yes, we will. And uh, more exciting videos are yet to come, so I will update the channel on a regular basis. On a regular basis, so I will let you all know, guys, when my next video will be. Until then, just keep an eye out for more videos. Uh, so we are doing well. We're at 909 subscribers, but hopefully, with this video being added, we could go higher. And we're almost heading for a thousand subscribers, so we will soon be hitting. The highest amount of subscribers that we would expect. But until then, hope you're enjoying these videos. So, all being well, we've got the 74A uh, penciled in. Um, so, all being well, the 74A will take place on Thursday. But I will make an announcement tomorrow to say... Uh, if it's going to be a yes or a no. Uh, so we will be doing the 74A hopefully. And also doing all the let's go routes in Wolverhampton. So I will keep you up to date with more videos that will come. Here on Joe's Bus Train Play and Lived Adventures. But until then. Just keep watching my videos. Because it is important that you keep watching. So we can still... Uh, keep a f stay afloat and introduce uh, more subscribers so it is great that we will continue to succeed um, uh, continue to succeed in more and more exciting videos uh, very soon in the not too distant future so uh, we've done most of all the first routes in Worcester um so, we will update everything. So, keep watching, guys, here on Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures. And uh, we have got the 826 coming soon, which goes from... Uh, was, uh, well, it goes from... So, we will be... So, we will get the 826 done very soon. So, I'll let you know when I'll be doing the 826. Uh, to Lidgefield from Stafford. So the 826 is going to come soon. And there will be a handful of more videos. Uh, coming along. So I will. I will. Uh, let you all know guys. When that will be happening. Until then. Uh, just keep watching. Enjoy the channel. Because it is important that you do enjoy my channel. Uh, because there are so many exciting videos to choose from here on Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures and I am pleased to say that we will uh, carry on with more videos very soon so just keep, keep watching yes, always keep watching because I know you like I know you how much you like watching my channel and uh, we will get there we will come through Everything we missed out over the years. So we will make sure that the channel is maintained. So we are nearly coming into... Um, so uh, we're nearly coming into Wensfield. So this is uh, going through the countryside. Uh, so we're going through the countryside now. So then, as you can tell, we are in, well, most the countryside. This is not a rural route. This is an urban route. So uh, we are going uh, through part of, on half of Woodend, 
um, the, which is also combined up with the 57, uh, the one to Bilston. Uh, so we are nearly going to be on our way towards um, Wensfield. So we'll be on our way towards Wensfield. So once we get to Wensfield, uh, the journey will terminate and that will complete our success uh, on the service uh, number. Uh, on the service number 50. Now, the 50 uh, was operated by Choice Travel, uh, which became D&G Midland. So, let me just take you through it. So, it was run by Choice Travel, which became D &G, which became Midland using the D&G branding. Um, so, it was taken over. Well, it was rebranded as that. And uh, D and G Midlands, they did a handful of services across the West Midlands. Then it was taken over by Arriva Midlands North, because uh, Arriva took over uh, D and G uh, Midlands, and like Chase Rider took over Arriva in Canuck. And uh, then in twenty seventeen, well, well in twenty sixteen. Uh, Diamond Buses took over the tender of the 50. So Diamond took over the tender. And that lasted until, I'm not sure, probably 2016 to 20, probably in 2017. Then it was taken over by Igo Buses. Uh, Igo Buses carried on running the service up until 2019. And then Igo went into administration. And... Um, the uh, operator that won the emergency tender uh, was Select Bus Services that operate services in Cannock and Stafford and recently took over the 242 uh, established to Kimver and they also had, took over some services up in Stone, North Staffordshire. Uh, so Select Buses won the, the emergency tender uh, but then it was taken over by this current operator, National Express West Midlands. Now, National Express West Midlands are currently running the tender at the moment. Uh, but that is going to likely soon get withdrawn. So this is soon going to likely face a sudden withdrawal uh, in the new year. So it's going to be a shame uh, to lose this iconic route, the 50. The 50 has been with um, NX for some time now. Uh, it will be missed. Of course it will. Um, so it will be missed. The 50 will be full stop uh, if it does go completely because I know it's going to cut off um, communities as well. So uh, it will be a shame to lose such an iconic route. And the 50 is an iconic route. So if I have missed anything out, don't worry. Um you can actually check out uh, how I used to originally do it when I was with my mate Lewis back in the in the day, which was just before the COVID nineteen pandemic. So, uh, as you know, I have shortened most clips out as well because due to the fact, um, due to the, uh, the the size of the video clips, uh, so most of it is all been knocked off but uh hope you enjoy it uh, but you can also watch my original version of when i used to do the 50 uh wolverhampton to wensfield otherwise i could just do like i might do another version of this the farewell uh 50 wolverhampton to wensfield that's if it does get withdrawn totally so if it does get withdrawn totally i will put like a video Farewell 50 Wolverhampton to Wensfield. Uh, so that is going to be uh, a disappointment if if we do have to say goodbye to it. Because it's been operating for many, many years now. And it is a shame that we're having to lose this route. Because due to the fact it's just no longer commercially viable to be continued under the Nash, under the West Midlands contract. Because as you know, the route is part of the West Midlands contract. Uh, so it is in doubt that it will ever come back into service again. 
So he is in doubt uh, that the service will ever be taken over by another operator. Uh, if it does get taken over by another operator, it might be taken over by Banga. Let's go. Maybe Diamond might have it again or maybe Select again. But I don't know what's going to happen. Uh, no one knows what's going to be the future of this route. Um, because it is a disappointment that we're losing so many op bus routes uh, since uh, they withdrew them during the COVID pandemic. So we just don't know what we're gonna ha what's going to happen to all these lovely routes. There might be talk of the twenty eight going uh, established trail zone. You never know. Dorman might get that route back. They might uh, consider reverting it back to the 287 and the 14, but might have to number the, the 14H. That's just, that's just uh, an idea, but it might just stay as the 28 altogether or might be numbered 28 and 28H. Um, but I just don't know what's going to happen at the moment. But until then, just keep watching... Uh, the video guys, Joe's Bus Train Play and Lift Adventures. So, no one knows what's going to happen. I'm sure there might be some change nearer the time, so there will be some change uh, coming around. Uh, the changes are going to come up in November, well, end of November. Tomorrow's the last day of October, which will be Halloween. So, Halloween's tomorrow, and I hope I wish you all a happy Halloween. To, and to all of us here on Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures. So it's going to be a happy Halloween. Um, so there will be a happy Halloween. So we will have a happy Halloween uh, this year. Uh, this year has been a lot better than 2020, the year when I took this. Because 2020... Everything came to a standstill. That was because due to coronavirus, COVID-19. Uh, but however, the coronavirus uh, pandemic is starting to ease a bit now. Because we've got to live with it now. And because it's just like a common cold. So, but I just hope that you can continue to watch my channel. As you can hear, there's a bit of fireworks going off because, as you know, uh, it will be Guy Fawkes night, uh, bonfire night on the 5th of November, which is next Saturday. Uh, so next Saturday is going to be the bonfire night. So there'll be a bonfire night next Saturday. Um, so bonfire nights next Saturday. And then um, then it's Remembrance Day next, the Sunday after. And then in no time at all, It'll be Christmas, so Christmas will be like in a month time just when November starts up. And I'm going to be so excited for Christmas. I'm going to be really excited for when Christmas comes around. And then we'll have New Year and we'll say goodbye to 2021. Uh, well, goodbye to 2022 and hello to 2023. So 2023... Uh, might be a better year than this year. Well, it's been better this year because we've had no uh, COVID lockdowns. Uh, but uh, next year, well, we've had the Ukraine war going on and also the uh, Russian war. But hopefully this year we'll get... Next year we might have the better years in, in years to come. So I just hope... You're going to continue to watch my video, look after yourselves, take care, and I'll see you all again soon for more exciting videos here on Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures. So anyway, we're just now coming into Wensfield, uh, so I hope you enjoyed the 50 all the way from uh, Wolverhampton. Uh, so we're now coming into, so we're nearly on the approach to Wensfield, so I hope you're enjoying uh, the remains of the video, so... Take care, look after yourselves, and uh, see you all again very soon for more Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures videos. Until then, it's a bye for now. Take care, see you soon. So, please don't forget, stay tuned, guys, here on Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures. Welcome to Wensfield, the terminus of the 50 service. 
Farnwall Wolverhampton.